against North Korea. In uh, regard to its latest nuclear test, the U.S. House gavels in momentarily a pro forma session only. They're back for legislative business next week. Now live to the House floor here on C-SPAN. The House will be in order. The chair now lays before the House communication from the Speaker. The Speaker's Rooms, Washington, D.C., March 7, 2013. I hereby appoint the Honorable Blake Farenfold to act as Speaker pro tempore on this day. Signed, John A. Boehner, Speaker of the House of Representatives. The prayer today will be offered by the guest chaplain, the Reverend Gene Hemrick from the Catholic University of America here in Washington, D.C. The uh, philosopher Martin Buber states, the primary aspiration of all history is a genuine community of human beings. Lord, we know that you desire the best for us and that this consists in our being the genuine human beings you meant us to be. This is and always has been the heart of our nation. May you bless this Congress with the wisdom, prudence, and understanding needed for generating the laws, ideals, and creativity to fulfill your heartfelt desires for us. Amen. The chair has examined the journal of the last day's proceeding and announces to the House as approval thereof. Pursuant to clause one of rule one, the journal stands approved. And the chair will now lead, uh, lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The chair lays before the House a communication. The Honorable the Speaker, House of Representatives, Sir, pursuant to Section 4D of House Resolution 5, 113th Congress, and Section 1K2 of House Resolution 895, 110th Congress, I transmit to you notification that Porter J. Goss, David Skaggs, Yvonne Burke, Jay Egan, Karen English, Bill Frenzel, Allison Howard, Mike Barnes, Omar Ashmawi, Kelly Brewington, William Cable, Mary Kay Flanagan, Scott Gast, Kedrick L. Payne, Paul Solis, and Nate Wright each have signed an agreement not to be a candidate for the office of Senator or Representative in or delegate or, delegate or resident commissioner to the Congress for the purposes of the Federal Election Campaign Act of 1971 until at least three years after he or she is no longer a member of the board or staff of the Office of Congressional Ethics. Copies of the signed agreements shall be retained by the Office of the Clerk as part of the records of the House. With best wishes, I am, signed sincerely, Karen L. Haas. Without objection, the clerk is directed to make the change in the engrossment of House Concurrent Resolution 20 that has been placed before the, be placed at the desk. Objection. The clerk will report the change. Strike Muhammad each place it appears and insert in each instance Muhammad. Without objection, the House will stand adjourned until 10 a.m. on Monday, March 11th. 
the House back next week for legislative work after yesterday.